I'm with uh, Chief Randall Henderson of Walter Volunteer Fire Department. Chief, I don't get to get to come out here very often. You guys must have a good fire prevention program. Well, we uh, we are very fortunate not to have many fires out here. Well, tell me about this one on uh, 641. It, it, it was fully involved for sure. Yeah, when the call come in, it come in as a fully involved structure fire. It actually come in through Blount County uh, E911. I guess somebody called in on cell phone and the tire picked up Blount County. So that may have delayed the response just a little bit. I follow you. Well, I imagine when you pulled up, there was a pretty big uh, plume of smoke coming up out here. So this, this, this house is pretty well burnt to the foundation. Yeah, well, when we got to the station, we could see the black smoke from the station before we, as we arrived at the station. Uh, and Hansville got here. It was already fully involved when Hansville got on the scene. Well, I guess Berlin was out here as well, right? Yes, Berlin. We really do appreciate the support that our neighboring departments give us. It really means a lot to us. Well, you guys work well together. I've been on several fires out here. So anything else you can tell us as far as the cause of the fire or anything you know? Well, not at this time. It's uh, under investigation, evaluation right now, so it'll just be determined at a later time. All right, well, Chief, thanks so much for talking to me. Thank you. Tim Collins with Coleman and I. I'm out on County Road 641. This is from the Walter community. I'm with Captain Jacob Hunt with Hansville Fire Rescue. Jacob, you were the first firefighter on the scene. What have we got here? Uh, we were called around 5 o'clock this evening for a report of a fully involved structure fire in Walter's area and dispatched to assist them with the fire. Well, obviously it's fully involved. Uh, there's no roof structure. We've got two by fours on the front part of the house. Looks like there might have been a basement you had to contend with as well. Yes, sir. Part of the structure did have a basement underneath it. Now, tell me about the occupants. Were they, were they out of the structure or what? No one was inside the structure at the time of the fire. That's good news. How about your firefighters? Everyone is well. Everyone is accounted for. No injuries, no heat-related illness either. That's fantastic. Check on a hot day like this. Now, I know you guys are here. I see Walter. I understood Berlin was here, but I don't see them at the moment. Uh, yes, sir. Berlin was here as well. They were the the last ones to arrive and they were the first ones to be released once we got the fire under control and had good water supply. Gotcha. Uh, it's probably too early to say, but uh, what are we looking at as far as causing the fire? Do you know? Uh, the cause of the fire is going to be under investigation at this time. I apologize. Is there anything else we need to know? Uh, no, sir. I would avoid this area of County Road 641 for the time being and probably for the next several hours. Yeah, it's, it's closed down out here. Thanks for talking to me. I'll let you get back to it. Thank you. Thank you, Tim.